Hip Hop Make the Show. Just Myself, Jay Hall, has got her DJ Academics. The Grammy nominations that came out earlier this week, and one of the biggest things that was being talked about was this is the first year in the Album of the Year category there are no white male artists being nominated at all. Um, one of the artists being nominated, well, here, here go the list of Album of the Year. Childish Gambino, Awaken My Love, Jay-Z's 444, Lord, Melodrama, Bruno Mars, 24 Karat Magic, and also, wasn't it Kendrick Lamar Dam? Yeah. Or am I tripping? Yeah, Kendrick Lamar Dam. And shout out to SZA because she is the uh, most nominated woman artist of 2018. And you know, I'm, I'm my hip hop crush is SZA at the current moment, so I'm, I'm all for it. Mm, yeah, SZA's going to be walking home with some hardware. Yeah, man. And Hov got a lot of nominations too for 444. You know, has, you know, when you think about like album of the year, we not to say who you think is going to win, who you think like should win when you hear that list, especially when you got like Jay Z and Kendrick both going for album of the year. I don't remember a time where two hip hop records were in the same, you know, running for album of the year. But just going off those two albums alone, which one would you say should win? Ah, uh, I mean, I'm gonna go with Jay. I'm gonna be 100 with you, man. You know how I was about damn all year, man. You know I was all about Kendrick, but I cannot front that 444. When I think about like album of the year and what it was doing for the culture, I think Jay, man, he came and did his Sinatra. He kind of edged Kendrick out a little bit, you know? So I think he'll probably deserve to win that. But at the end of the day, I think Bruno Mars is going to walk away with that. Or Lord, just because I highly doubt when you put a category like that with the Grammys and there's only one woman in there, that they're going to allow one of those brothers to win over that woman, that white woman. But don't even lie. We, we, um, we consider Bruno, even though he's not white, we consider him one of those pop. Oh, as a pop artist, he's definitely, they don't consider him like a black artist. I they definitely think he's, he's a winner. He's not considered a, a minority artist. No, he's not. Artist. He's not. But or that doesn't mean that. Whatsoever. That doesn't mean that 24 Karat um, Gold was not a good album, though. For, no, for most he's definitely dope. I mean, I, I, and black, I'm not even, different, but I'm just saying. Yeah, yeah. And I'm personally not even a, a, a fan of Bruno Mars, but I can see it. You know what I'm saying? I'm saying, like, objectively, I get how he can be nominated. And if he was the win, I wouldn't I wouldn't be upset about it, to be honest with you. But I'm, I'm rooting for Jay. For Jay to win album of the year, that'd be real big in King Ho. Like, definitely you could put the crown on him, like, as he, like. He's done. Yeah, he like he can walk away from that. He's gonna do the album with Beyonce and he out. Hey, yeah, yeah. Like I, I don't need no more, man. Cause I don't know if you're gonna have another album like this that's gonna bring our attention, you know, for 444, like the way 444 did. That's that's what I'm saying. You you can walk away after this. Album.